Hey Philosotube, Ashley here, Buggy Stitcher on YouTube, Shlizm underscore Buggy Stitcher on Instagram, coming to you guys with another unboxing. This is a new company for me. Their name is Fanzels. Um, big cross stitch store and uh, yeah, lots to talk about. So let's go ahead and dive right in. I'll leave all of their information in the description box down below in case you are interested. So I got a couple of projects for me. I got one for Nana, one for my mom. So let's just go ahead and dive right in. Lots of crinkling. I didn't open anything this time. All right, first one is for my mom. She is hardcore into foxes and it just looked like a very calm woman with a bunch of cozy foxes in her hair, which was really cool. So she's excited about this one. Okay, it looks like the pattern is on poster paper. It's a 40 by 50. It only comes with 22 colors. I'm kind of surprised about that because, I don't know, it seems like there would be a lot of colors in the foxes and the bird and everything, but we'll see. Um, pattern is pretty readable. Um, yeah, looks pretty good. There's the whole thing. There's a face. I'm, I like it when you can, see, you can see what it is on the pattern. I don't like it when you like look at the pattern and you can't even tell like what it is. But you can see her face and her hair and the, the um, boxes. This one came with two of the good needles. I need to, there we go. I need to look on this side apparently. <laughs> two of the good needles. This one came with huge margins. Um, not serge, but very big margins. It looks like it has a blue and a light, a light blue and a green slash, which might be kind of hard to see if they put those next to each other. Ah, no, you can tell. The is really good. So you can, you can see what it is at least. So there's the whole pattern. Here's the margin, it's about three inches. And um, let me show you the spot that has the green and the blue together. If I can find it again, there it is. All right, it's right here. So I could see at least the blue and the green separately. Um, yeah. Sammy is really good. It's pretty, th it's pretty stiff, but you can work it out, so that's fine. So yeah, here's the whole pattern. The dang window behind me. <laughs> All right, let's get into the colors. Huh, brown is a little tangly. There we go. Okay. There's those. All very autumny colors. There is no blue for the bird though, so I'm a little bit surprised about that because the pattern shows how the bird has a blue head. And there's there's no blue, there's like a bluish gray color. But that's it, so we'll see. We'll see how that turns out. And that's it for that one. Put it all back together. All right, next up we have one for me. Lots of crinkling, sorry. All right, so this one is a picture of the Aurora Borealis for the Northern Lights. Super pretty. So there's that. This is a 40 by 50 as well. And it has 30 colors. Here's the whole pattern. Poster paper. And symbols. I don't see any that are gonna pose a problem, so that's nice. We'll see though. All right, this one comes with two of the good needles. 
and really big margins. Oh, but the stamping is awful. Whew. Uh, really big margins, a really clear key. That's nice, a really big picture. There's your key. But the stamping is pretty blurry. Um, I think I could tell what it is, but just for example, like the, the red slash looks like two slashes. Um, so I'll show you that. So it looks like two slashes instead of one. Um, so that's kind of a bummer. It's a little bit blurry. I still think I can do it. I just won't be able to work on it for a very long time. Um, here's like our greater than sign. You can barely tell what it is. I think it looks a little bit better on camera, so that's cool. There's that. All right, so here's the whole, the whole thing. And the colors. Very pretty colors. Again, there's 30 colors, no extras. Okay, so there's that side. And then this side. Very pretty. That's it for that one. Next up we have one for my Nana. Bring and find that opening to the package. <laughs> okay. So this one is a bouquet of roses. Very pretty. The colors in this I'm expecting to be gorgeous. This is also a 40 by 50, um, and the symbols on the stamped goods. So there is a red box and then a red box with a yellow outline. That might be a little bit tricky. <coughs> Excuse me. But other than that, it looks like it should be okay. Um, poster paper. And this one comes with 30 colors. And this is a DIY as well, so this one should come with two of the better needles. Actually, I don't see any needles. This one does not come with any needles. Unless they're stuck somewhere. So no needles on this one. Um, it comes with a very big margin, about three inches. You have the big picture and the big key. And this one is also very blurry which is unfortunate. Um, yeah, so I'll show you this section right here. Pretty blurry, at least to me. Um, you can tell what the symbols are, but because the symbols are significantly different than the other symbols, but yeah, it's pretty blurry. It's like everything's stamped in this time frame had a problem with their printer. So if you have that happen, you can reach out to your the person that you got these from and request either a PDF, um, a PDF pattern uh, to work off of. Um, and sometimes you can also request a new stamping if it's really bad. But most of the time I just request a PDF pattern, which I'll probably do for these two that I just unboxed that are blurry. Um, because it's really hard to tell. Um, and I prefer not to work on off of a printer printed pattern because that's what I do for counted. Um, you know, that's the whole point of stamp is to be easy, but you know, it is what it is. So we have a big giant hank of 310, which is black, but I, they tied it and I don't like the tie. So I'm gonna undo the tie really fast and turn it into a hank. Cause that is what I prefer. Except I'm doing it backwards. <laughs> I'm right-handed, so I should have it in the other hand. Makes it a little easier, but that's okay. Here we go. So now I have a hank of black. And there's also a hank 
of 939, my nemesis color. There we go. Lots of pretty springy colors. Got some pinks, reds and blues. There we go. So if they have too much of a color, they normally just string it through like this and it's not like tied around. So I normally fix that for my Nana because she, she doesn't like it like that. So I'll fix that for her really fast. And because it's too thick to all go on one, what I do is I just split the, the amount that they give me in half and I just do two loops through it. I'll show you guys what I mean. Oh, they're doing it the opposite way of what I normally do. Hold on, I have to think about this. Okay, so we're gonna put these through. All right, so there is one that I just did, but I'm gonna do another one right in the same hole. It's just gonna be a different, a different thing. Because all they can fit in the hole, it's just hard to, to tie it all together. So, there we go. So it looked kind of crazy, but that's, that's what I do. So there we go. That's it for that one. And that one's Nana's. All right, and last but not least is another one for me. And this one is not a DIY. This one is a different, just like off brand, which is good because this brand normally has really good stamping. So hopefully it's good. Uh, this is a 40 by 56. So she's got like different series of the moons. She's got this beautiful dress, I think. I think. Oh yeah, so she's kind of a witch and she's got a snake. So here's like a, a witch hat and there's like a snake wrapped around her arm. So she looks pretty cool. She almost looks like a mermaid though, but she's not. So on poster paper, a really big pattern. So we have the picture and some instructions and then we have the really big printed pattern, which is really nice. Yeah, I can easily read, so that's good. This one has 35 colors, and I'm looking at the symbols to see. So there's a red and an orange circle, like a dot thing. Um, that might pose a problem. Other than that, it should be just fine. This one comes with a toolkit. It's got a pom-pom with some gold tip needles, a thimble, and a needle threader. And as I predicted, this one is stamped beautifully. Um, it has small margins, but it's searched all the way around, so it doesn't really matter. So it's about a two, two inch, maybe an inch and a half, probably an inch and a half, actually. Um, here's the whole thing. I really need to do something with this window. Maybe that's a little better? I don't know. No, not really. <laughs> I'll show you guys in half. So there's this half and this half. This is gonna be so pretty. So 18, which is the yellow. I'm curious if it's a green or if it's a 939. And it's 939. Uh, yeah, so all the stamping on this is extremely well, well done. Um, really enjoy the stamping when it's like this. If I can see it, it's really nice. All right, we have some extra colors on this one. We have two, um, f uh, what is it, B, five, 2,000? No, just five, 5,200. Um, it's like a white, but this white um, that comes with the CXC right now, it kind of looks a, an off pinkish, off purple, I'm not sure. All right, next up we have Two different pinks. We have an 819 and a 963. 
extra hanks. And then we have the colors. <laughs> that are all tangled. Okay, there we go. So again, 35 colors. All pretty light colors, honestly. I was kind of expecting a lot of dark colors. Um, but I'm really excited about this one. And that is it for today. Thank you all so much for joining me. I really appreciate every single one of you. Thank you, Fansouls, for sending these over to me. Again, I'll leave their information in the description box down below. And I hope you all have a fabulous day. Stay safe, stay warm, and take care. Bye.